So you've got grit and debris in your coating film. If your wood project looks more like a piece of 80 grit sandpaper than a piece of fine furniture, don't fear. I'm Daryl Young with ML Campbell and you've reached the finish line. Welcome back to the finish line. Today we're going to talk about grit or debris in your wood coating film. And this can take the form of a consistent gritty appearance or it can be the odd piece of something in the surface or kind of embedded in the coating of the film. There's a variety of different sources of this grit or debris where it might be coming from. It could be in your coating, in your equipment, it could be landing on the surface of the coating, it could be in your atomizing air or it could be something that's happening to the coating after it's been applied to the surface. If it's in your coating, it could be pigment, colorant, that has re-agglomerated into larger particles. It could be the fact that your coating material is just old, or it was just not properly mixed. It's critical to mix your coating thoroughly before you spray it to get consistent sheen and color but also to make sure that there are no chunks or particles of material in the coating. If the problem is in your spray equipment, it's important to make sure that all of the fluid lines are clean without any buildup of old material or residue on the inside. We also want to make sure that your spray guns are routinely torn down and thoroughly cleaned. It's not enough to just put a little bit of solvent through the spray gun after you use it. To thoroughly clean the gun it's important to take it apart, disassemble it, and clean out all those interior passageways, at least periodically, if not after every use. As far as on the coating goes, once the coating is sprayed, it remains wet for a period of time. And while it's wet, it's very easy for airborne particles, dust, fibers to land on the surface of the coating and show up as kind of a gritty or contaminated surface. And this one, is probably the single most common cause of the problem. So by all means, make sure that the environment in which you're spraying is free from a lot of airborne dust and fibers. Don't be spraying coatings if you're wearing an Angora sweater. Make sure you're wearing clothing that doesn't give off a lot of fibers and dust. The grit in your coating may actually also be tiny little air bubbles that are the result of air entrapped during the atomization process. When all the little particles of material, of paint, that you've sprayed out of your spray gun hit the wood, they trap tiny pockets of air between them and those air bubbles need to rise to the surface and resolve. If your coating dries too quickly before that is able to happen, those bubbles may rise to the surface and form little tiny domes that appear as grit in the coating film. And that's a, another very common cause of what appears to be a gritty appearance. If you take care of all these steps, you will hopefully be able to overcome your grit and debris problem with your wood coating. So thanks for joining us again today on this episode of The Finish Line. Make sure to leave comments or questions below, like, share, subscribe to this video, and we hope to see you again next time. Thank you.